Hi guys, my name is Megan and today I've got a TBR cart clean out update for you. So uh, let's just go ahead and dive right in. All right guys, so it has, hasn't been that long since I did my last TBR cart update. I did one back in March and I will leave a link up in the corner to that video. But um, as you guys can see, there has been um, significant uh, changes since the last time that I did this video. So uh, let's go ahead and dive into what all is currently on my TBR card and then as we go we'll start uh, unhauling some stuff. Okay first up are these very precarious stacks of manga at the very top. So I have a copy of the Charm Offensive that I got off of that I got off of Pango Books. I do have a Pango Books account if you guys want to follow me over there. I do have some books up for sale and it is linked down in the description box. Um, I have What If It's Us. This one I picked up from the little free library next door. Um, I've got Chain of Gold, which I was going to read, I think in May, but I didn't get around to. Then I've got a stock of manga. I've got uh, Seven Days, Monday through Sunday, Haikyuu Volume 2, This Wonderful Season of You, or With You, uh, Replay. I have Only a Monster, Yagi the Bookshop Goat, Given Volume 1, There Are Things I Can't Tell You, The Cat Proposed, and Dekoboko Sugar Days. And then I do have a bunch more in the back that we'll get to in a minute. So next up I have Circle of the Moon, Smoke Bitten, I have a Dress for the Wicked, and I do still want to read that. We have Wicked Hour, The Summoner Battle Mage, Crier's War, Vespertine, All of Us Villains, the Ghosts of the Shadow Markets, The Ones We're Meant to Find, Lessons in Vengeance, which I think... This one I'm on the fence about keeping. Uh, Magnus Chase and the Gods of Asgard, uh, Thor, or Hammer of Thor. And we've got a whole bunch of other stuff. So we have Swamp Thing Twin Branches, Therapy Game Restart Volume 1, Teen Titans Beast Boy Loves Raven, Hookie, we've got Heavy Vinyl Y2KO, The Backstagers, Red Hood and the Outlaws Volume 5, Red Hood and Arsenal Volume 1, Red Hood and Arsenal Volume 2, Nightlights, and The Magnificent Book of Dragons. Okay, so second shelf, we have The City We Became, which I'm thinking I'm gonna end up selling just because I just don't feel like this is one that I'm gonna end up reading anytime soon. So this one I think I'm ready to part ways with. Um, next up we have Master of One, which I'm still desperately wanting to read. I don't know if I'll ever get around to it though. Another one that I would desperately like to read is We Hunt the Flame. However, my brain and I are not on speaking terms about fantasy books at the moment, so there's that. I do have This Poison Heart, which looks really cute. Goddess in the Machine, this is one that I'm not sure I'm gonna read either. Um, next up we have These Violent Delights, which I'm a little on the fence about. At this point, I'm still wanting to keep it. Um, we have Sweet and Bitter Magic, which I've heard great things about, but again, fantasy books and I are not on speaking terms at the moment, so that is a maybe. Um, we scavenge the, or scavenge the Stars, which again, fantasy book, not 100% on board right now. Um, Magnus Chase and the Ship of the Dead. Um, we have Owl and the Tiger Thieves, which has been on this TBR for a long time at this point. The Trials of Apollo, The Hidden Oracle, my copy of In Other Lands, which I DNF'd a while back. I'm still kind of wanting to get back into that. And the last one I have on the shelf is Fable. All right, and then on this very bottom tier, we have The Lives of Laquamora, The Dragon Riders of Pern, bind up for the first three books. Uh, Daughter of the Siren Queen, which I DNF'd at some point and I will get back to eventually. Um, we have Wicked, Among the Beasts and Briars, Bone Shaker, The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue, Star Daughter, which I think I'm going to sell this one because I sold my other copy and I just, I don't think I'm ever going to read this one. I have Legendborn, which I'm a little on the fence. I know I've heard really good things about it, but I, I'm not 100% sure on this one. Um, Succubus in the City, 
I've got Dark Frost, which has been sitting here for a long time. And last but not least, I have Girl Serpent Thorn, which is one that I'm currently on the fence about too. So a lot of the books that are currently on like the bottom shelves of this, I'm really on the fence because they're fantasy books. And I'm not sure, I think my reading tastes have changed quite a bit in the last year, year and a half, um, because I've definitely noticed that YA high fantasy is just not what I want anymore. So there's probably gonna be a ton of YA fantasy books on my Pango Shop account, which I will leave like down below. All right, so that is it for this TBR cart clean out update. Um, if you guys like this video, don't forget the like button. If you haven't already but would like to, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And if you'd like to follow me on social media for more bookish stuff, check out the links down below. Alrighty, bye guys!